हेलो एवरीवन आई एम आदित्य आवारे एंड आई एम अ स्टूडेंट ऑफ एस वाई आई टी सो वी आर हियर टू कंडक्ट आवर थर्ड एक्टिविटी व्हिच इज अबाउट सीइंग एन इमेज एंड देन डिस्क्राइबिंग इट इन इन टू 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 मिनट्स गैप uh the, this activity will uh, will be conducted in a format where the first person will be speaking about image a and the last person will be speaking about image j so here uh, first we will start with saurabh nanekar who will be seeing the first image and he will speak about it saurabh your your image is uh, this one yes so now i can start uh, here in this image we can clearly say that for reach at any path means for achieving our goals or achieving our dreams in our life we have to focus on our dreams or we have to tackle that path and we also go on the track with this path because uh, if we see for achieving our goal, goal if we stray from our uh, path which is shown in this image the person has to climb over the that all and he has that leader uh, ladder but he for the for the sake of it enjoyment he he just uh, use this ladder steps for uh, for his enjoyment for the particular moment uh, because of that moment he uh, he never reached the way uh, or the destination where he want as uh, we learn from that image that for reach our goal or achieving something in our life we have to remove, uh, we have to focus on our goal or on our uh, we have to uh, stick on our path we don't have to distract from our path and uh, for reaching at or achieving our goal we have to focus on our path and we have to tackle that path in any situation for a sake of enjoyment we don't have to lose uh, we don't have to distract from that path this is shown in this image a great like great uh, way of describing the image uh, next i would like to uh, share the next image which will be the beep image and uh, next person will uh, describe it so he, here uh, here i show the uh, here is the next image uh, i am tejal yavalkar and i will speak on this image so here we can say that uh, as a concrete world wherein there are lot of skyscrapers and on the below down a lot of traffic is there as we all know we live in a world of concrete nowadays and uh, technology is really on a very high so uh, similarly in the image we can see the skyscrapers uh, and the traffic which is uh, which is depicting the real world and the uh, real fact into which we live in today in which we live in today here uh, we all know that industrial revolution 4 have it has been said that industrial revolution 4 has been started and this concrete world will go uh, on increasing more and more but using technology as a boon uh, is the correct way or uh, we can prove it as a boon for human uh, and if we misuse it it can actually be a curse for human uh, life uh, so the Uh, by seeing the uh, seeing this image i like to uh, conclude this uh, conclude this uh, my few words by saying that uh, ha- having a technology a blessing will be surely a very great uh, opportunity or a very great way to enlighten the human life ahead else it can destroy life also thank you that was a great great way of describing the image teja next i will show the uh, c image and the next person will describe it it's yeah you are visible on that you can go on so cool by seeing this image i first of all imagine the current way of living your life by a person Where is someone guiding our one path, and we are following just one path? Uh, we don't know where we need to be. It is our destination. Here is a two doors where one uh, person shows us the way for, but uh, still we have followed uh, that door. This family has uh, have wanted to have a peaceful or simple, comfortable life, but uh, that dad or whatever that person showing. The, 
will direction to there and uh, there reach will one door that is not their own destination the another door is their destination but no one seeing that part of the, their lives or in their life so uh, someone deciding the our faith or our destination is the wrong way that we live in today's life life is shown in by this image clearly thank you thank you omkar that was a great way of describing how the life is going on and how there is a illusion of life uh, so next i will show the uh, d image and uh, the next person will tell about us tell it tell about it. hello everyone uh, so my name is ritesh and uh, as i have seen the image uh, i believe that uh, it shows that uh, how childs behave uh, as they are seeing their adults uh, do things uh, near them so it shows that uh, every father uh, i mean not just father every adult uh, they see around them they try to behave uh, they try to behave like them and uh, uh, i guess that uh, they learn uh, everything from their adults and uh, it's a message that exactly like right it is it is a great way of describing how the image is about how parents the knowledge of parent goes goes to the student uh, like to the, his child uh, next i would show the uh, e image and uh, will next person will discuss about it hello everyone my name is shivaj shivaj dev uh as shown in the image the image uh, like uh, describes the uh, how our young uh, generation caught in a computer uh, prison like a uh, computer addiction so the computer addiction is uh, uh, something which hear a lots of these days many of us stay in a front of computer hours or online or offline this kind of act may interfere with our daily routines relationships and our well being computer addiction can result from variety of things such as an unusual amount of time in front of your computer it means you are suffering from computer addiction so uh, to overcome these uh, addictions uh, we have to reduce the uh, uh, our time to spend over the computer and uh, we can use a stopwatch to reduce your computer or it will remain remain you so doing all these activities uh, i think we are safe to caught in computer prison uh, thank you anita thank you rusuraj great way of describing how what the image is thank you uh, the next i will show you the next image and the uh, next person will uh, tell you about it the f the image is here hello everyone my name is rutraj harikadam so as shown in the picture there is a one man who is cutting the tree and uh, behind the man there are many trees as uh, i think there uh, the man cutting the tree for money but rather than for, uh, for uh, showing importance for the money we have to plant more trees but the importance of the trees uh, is not uh, spread everywhere so they are cutting trees and build the building everywhere and uh, as we all know the importance of the trees that uh, trees give us the oxygen to our carbon dioxide also give us the shelter and uh, so there are many advantages of the trees but we are going in a uh, bad way that we are cutting the trees so no uh, there is no importance for money uh, greater than the trees so we have to plant more trees thank you thank you rutraj a great way of describing how humans greed is destroying the uh, atmosphere or the nature all around us uh, so the next image will be jeet image and uh, next person will describe it right now hello i am chaitrali namda uh i am going to describe this image uh this image shows about the electricity in the form of human which is going to hang on there uh and we have to go for candles without bulb as we know energy consumption is growing day by day 
uh, in one day there is one day uh, will there is no one uh, no electricity in the earth uh, we have to conserve the electricity people have to uh, aware about the electricity and do not consume as much uh, life without electricity would be impossible to imagine now people do not real, realize the natural resources uh, to do as are limited uh, and non renewable we must conserve the electricity so that we can conserve the uh, conserve the resources each the, uh, and we have to save the energy uh, so i am concluding by saying that keep calm and conserve electricity and save uh, as your life depends on you thank you chaitra ali uh, the next image will be the etched image and uh, next person will describe it anikit you are not clearly visible uh aditya actually my camera is not working uh, okay you can go ahead then okay so in this image we are seeing that uh, son is uh, son is uh, taking his parents for a visit uh, near the sea in which he see, he imagines that how his parents uh, how his parents uh, taking him uh, taking him during his childhood uh, during his childhood he remembers all that is imaginary uh, all that uh, things which he has done how his parents take care of him now it is uh, his time to take care of them Uh, he also remembers uh, that how good uh, to be uh, thank you that's all. okay and you get uh, next uh, the next image is in front of you hello this is the ait image so uh, the next person can continue is my voice audible yes sir yeah hello everybody can you hear me i can see that totally involved in mobile thing he has got two new mobile apps so as we know that this is our 21 century and so sure. sure your voice is like uh, getting cut in between and uh, again connecting so can you please like hold the mic in close to you hello is my voice is audible yes yeah, sir the you are audible no there is no so hello everyone my name is shraddha jagannath mane and uh, in this picture i can see that a mobile uh, a person is totally involved in mobile phones so he has got him in mobile phones 
so in this 21 uh, generation we all know that we are all attracted towards the uh, social media but as we know that the coin has two sides if there is a good thing then there is bad thing also so why we use mobile phone because mobile phone uh, in mobile phone we can make a call we can message but if we use excess amount of uh, the mobile phone then there is then there are many side effects uh, like um, uh, children play games for more times and this will hamper their studies and people have become addicted to the social media sites apps such as facebook twitter whatsapp for a long duration but today generation has become so much addicted to the smartphone that they keep checking their phones again and again without any reason due to which they are unable to use their important work correctly and nowadays people keep talking on mobile phone driving while uh, while and that's why accidents happen more use of mobile phone also weaks the memory because we save everything in mobile phone itself and do not try to remember and excess use of smartphone is a waste of time as most people waste their precious time watching the phones without any reason so my uh, so my point of view is that your time is precious don't waste your time to that much thing which is not important to our life just uh, main, um, just you just time table your life because the life is uh, the time is not come again that's why you have to manage your uh, things and just Uh, make just make to uh, just dream big and try to focus on that dream and don't use a uh, and don't use mobile phone um, repeatedly. <laughs> That's it. Thank you. Great way of describing how social media addiction is destroying the youth right now. So uh, next will be the Jay Timesh. So are they? Am I visible? Yeah, you are visible, Pratamesh. You can go ahead. Audible. Yep. Yes. So myself, Pratamesh Sabre, and uh, as we see in the picture, uh, there. As we see in the picture, uh, there is a group of people standing in the row. Actually, uh, the people in the picture are uh, standing in the ascending order. Seems like uh, the person who is the, at the highest. Who is uh, on the top seems to be at the highest position. Uh, that the, apparently the scenario looks like uh, people uh, below the one who is at the top uh, wants the person behind him to remove the mask. Like everyone taking the person, but at the address to for uh, some reason uh, the person at the highest starts this cycle and blames the below the uh, one below the for uh, working under his hands uh, under his hands and then uh, the person at the highest level the uh, highest or under the highest by all of all the women as per my opinion uh, uh, this Yeah, Pratham. It's great way of describing how the corporate system nowadays is working. So, uh, as everyone has concluded and uh, told their views about their images, I would like to conclude the activity here. And this is I mark the end of the activity three for the uh, group vision squad.